Hello and welcome back to Rich Reviews. Today I've got a new watch from Wish.com. Supposedly an original, but I'm not 100% sure, so let's have a look. It's the Seiko. So let's have a look at it outside the box. Obviously it's not the best box. That's why it makes me wonder if it is a real one. The blue dial looks nice, does look like waves, like on the original ones but I don't think it's the right colour to pull that off. Okay, so there's the dial. The um, hands around the edge do work, I believe. Let's just press that. So that's the ticker, and as you can see, it's not the best mechanism definitely a quartz movement the buttons don't even feel that good quality to be honest it's a little bit disappointing because this watch was about 40 pounds I'll let you into a little secret I did tell them that I wasn't happy with it and I did get a full refund which is not a good thing for them but they need to if it is saying that it's an authentic watch they need to make sure that it is an authentic watch coming to you because there are rules and regulations about this if they sell fakes then you know they're obliged to refund you so and that's 99 percent of the watches on wish.com unfortunately they are copies but, you know, this would have cost £200 if it wasn't original. The weight on it, you know, it is real weighty. I'm not sure what the actual weight is. Let's have a look at that strap. Yeah, so it's got Seiko on the strap, as you can see. And if we peel that off... not the nicest of straps to be honest I mean look at that it's cheap quality as far as that's concerned let's have a look at the back so yeah it's got a nice back on there not even sure what that is and it's marked up well it's etched on the back Seiko whatever that dial is, which I can't figure it out. If anything, it looks like a rose, but I don't think it is a rose. But anyway, it says stainless steel on the back. It's a screw back. Air divers. 200 meters. thing is these aren't etched that great because you can't really make it out could be my eyesight a lot of it but yeah so it says uh, movement Japan so I'm guessing that's quartz movement Japan uh, I mean you can hear the strap not great quality rattles around like a cheap Rolex copy as well. But there's the dial, the bezel, it does turn, it is rather stiff, but the tap test, it doesn't rattle when you tap it. On the actual winder, there's no S or anything on there to indicate it's a C cone, it is there. Again, as I say, my eyesight's not the best. I think uh, it's just a polished head there. Two buttons there, and they are really stiff, so I'm not 100% sure if they actually do do anything. I don't 
think they do work, those side ones. Which is a shame. We've got this funny marker here, and this isn't anything to do with the original. The original one doesn't have that on there. It does have date down the bottom there. But, you know, the watch was free as it is, so not too bad really. I would just say watch anything you buy off Wish, obviously I've had a lot of people say oh it's a, it's a fake, well yeah it is a fake but they advertise a lot of their stuff on there as an original authentic product and obviously that's a complete lie so <coughs> yeah the bezel does turn quite well as I say, I wouldn't pay £40 for it again, not being that quality. I'd want to have it a lot better than that. This obviously peels off, you can feel that it's just got a plastic film over the top, so that will brighten up. As I say, I think the original has a more darker blue face on it. So if you can pick one up for £20 as a copy, it, I'd say it's probably worth it, but not 40. It's just bunch. It's just a, too much money for that, I would say. But for more reviews, come back for more, because I have ordered some more watches off Wish, so you don't get robbed like I do at times. So just be wary when you buy anything from Wish. It probably is fake. Because as I say, on there... Um, terms and conditions it does say that if it's advertised as authentic and it isn't then they will refund you so you might get a few free watches out of it <laughs> okay so thanks for watching and come back for more reviews soon goodbye